Are you ready to discover the future of travel in Florida? Join us for an in-depth look at Brightline's high-speed train service and discover why it's quickly becoming the preferred choice for travelers. From its speed and efficiency to its comfort and convenience, we'll take you on a journey to explore all that Brightline has to offer. Stick around until the end to find out about the company's exciting expansion plans and how it's changing the way we travel. Welcome back to our Build to Innovate channel, where we take you on a journey through the most innovative and exciting building projects from around the world. Today, we are going to explore the Brightline Florida Train, a state-of-the-art high-speed rail system connecting Miami, Fort Lauderdale, West Palm Beach, and Orlando. Brightline's rail service has rapidly gained popularity among travelers in Florida thanks to its frequent, comfortable, and modern trains. Since its launch in 2018, the service has transported over 1.5 million passengers, despite starting with only three stations. This success demonstrates not only the service's convenience and reliability, but also the potential of rail transportation as an alternative mode of travel. Brightline is the first privately held intercity passenger railroad in the United States in nearly 40 years and has an ambitious expansion plan in place to connect more Florida cities and make rail travel more accessible to the public. The Brightline Florida train offers a comfortable and convenient travel experience for passengers with amenities such as spacious seating, Wi-Fi, power outlets, and food and beverage service. The train also features large windows, allowing for beautiful views of Florida scenery during the journey. The Brightline Florida train is powered by cutting-edge technology, featuring advanced aerodynamics, energy-efficient systems, and a lightweight design that allows for faster speeds and a smoother ride. The train is also designed to be environmentally friendly, with features such as LED lighting and a rainwater harvesting system. The Brightline Florida train stations are designed to be modern and convenient, with amenities such as ample parking, bike storage, and easy access to public transportation. The stations also feature retail and dining options for passengers to enjoy before or after their journey. Brightline Florida is dedicated to offering its customers frequent and reliable departure options. This is evident in its schedule, which provides 17 trays per day in both directions, providing customers with more options for their travel plans and shorter wait times, resulting in faster overall trips. To cater to the needs of its passengers, the Brightline train schedule is designed to be flexible, with hourly departures from early in the morning to late in the evening, allowing passengers to make and adjust their plans without having to worry about the train schedule. Furthermore, the company offers additional services and adjustable departure times to accommodate major sporting and concert events, ensuring that fans can rely on catching the train to get them home. The Brightline Florida Trains route connects Miami, Fort Lauderdale, West Palm Beach, and Orlando, providing a convenient and fast transportation option for travelers. The train can reach speeds of up to 79 miles per hour, reducing travel time between cities and making it a viable alternative to driving or flying. The train is expected to reach the Orlando International Airport, MCO, from Miami in just three hours, making it a quick and convenient option for travelers. Additionally, the train will take approximately two hours from West Palm Beach, which is an hour less than it would take to drive. This means that passengers can save valuable time and avoid the hassle of traffic and parking by choosing to travel by train. With the high-speed train service, Brightline provides a fast and comfortable alternative to traditional forms of transportation. In December 2022, Brightline's rail service was expanded to include two new stops, Aventura and Boca Raton. This created a five-stop train route, connecting Miami, Fort Lauderdale, West Palm Beach, Aventura, and Boca Raton. The new stations are designed with modern amenities such as free high-speed Wi-Fi, touchless turnstiles, and multiple lounge spaces for passengers to relax and wait for their trains. The Aventura station also offers a complimentary shuttle service to the nearby Aventura Mall, making it even more convenient for passengers. Similarly, the Boca Raton station provides a complimentary shuttle service to downtown Boca Raton, allowing passengers to easily explore the city before or after their train ride. Brightline understands that the journey doesn't end when a passenger arrives at the station, which is why it has placed a strong emphasis on the first and last mile connectivity. To address this, the company recently introduced Brightline Plus, a mobility service that helps riders get to and from the station. With Brightline Plus, passengers can choose from a variety of options such as 
kilometers private ride, shared shuttle, or even a bike to take them anywhere within a five-mile radius of the station. This allows for a door-to-door -door booking experience, eliminates the need for driving or finding parking at the station, making the overall travel more convenient and eco-friendly. Brightline Plus service makes it easy for passengers to fully utilize the benefits of high-speed rail and leave their car at home. Brightline has plans for a new station in the heart of the Orlando International Airport, offering passengers the most direct connection between an intercity rail line and an airport terminal in the United States. The station offers easy pedestrian access to the new Terminal C under construction on the south end of the airport and also to the existing Terminal A and B using an elevated people mover system. This type of well-coordinated link between trains and planes is a norm in Europe and Asia, and it is considered a key part of making both forms of transportation more successful. The new station is made possible thanks to a master rail plan that was put in place in the 1990s, which reserved the right of way through the airport and included a railway station. Brightline has found a way to overcome the challenges of building new high-speed lines by making use of existing transportation corridors. Land acquisition from new infrastructure can be costly, time-consuming, and controversial. However, by using existing transportation corridors, Brightline is able to avoid these issues. For example, from Miami to Coco, Brightline is upgrading the current Florida East Coast Railway mainline to be shared by both passenger and freight trains. Additionally, agreements have been reached to use the existing right-of-way of the Beachline Expressway between Coco and Orlando. This approach not only saves money by avoiding the need to purchase thousands of individual parts but also helps to keep the project affordable and efficient. Brightline is taking a phased approach to its expansion and development in order to optimize revenue and take advantage of infrastructure improvements as they are completed. In 2018, Brightline trains began serving Miami, Fort Lauderdale, and West Palm Beach, which allowed the company to test and improve their service before expanding to other cities. In the next phase of expansion, service will be extended to the Orlando International Airport following a $4 billion expansion project. This extension will provide a convenient and direct connection between the airport and the three other cities that Brightline currently serves. The company is now exploring the possibility of extending the line further, from the airport to Tampa, with potential stops at Walt Disney World and Lakeland, as well as a connection to Orlando's SunRail commuter train. This would significantly increase the reach and accessibility of the Brightline service, providing more travel options within Florida. The Brightline Florida train is more than just a transportation option. It's a journey through Florida's beautiful scenery and vibrant culture. It's a convenient, fast, and eco-friendly way to travel and explore the state. What do you think about the Brightline Florida train? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe to our channel for more updates on the most innovative and exciting building projects from around the world.